Hello, this video that I'm doing today is on the Amazon App Store. Now, um, the Amazon App Store is something that I used quite a bit three years ago when I got my first Android phone. Um, and as um, I have grown um, with my phone, I stopped using it. Um, the number one reason why I stopped using the Amazon App Store is because I have to have the Amazon App Store installed in order to use the apps that I get from the Amazon App Store. Now, I'm already forced to do that with the Play Store, so I just didn't want, um, and I'm not really forced to do that with the Play Store, but that's where I get most of my apps, and that's where, um, I mean, I, I definitely know I have to always have the Play Store installed. So I didn't want something else to force me to do that, and I didn't want really to be getting my apps from a bunch of different places and not know, because there was one time where I was still using the Amazon App Store, and I went to install um, a few of the apps from Titanium Backup, and I hadn't reinstalled the Amazon App Store, and it said in order to use this app, you have to go and install the Amazon App Store. And so just because they they forced me to continue to keep that, even though I may not want it, I may have gotten a few apps and decided I don't want it, I don't really use it. But one of the things I love about the Amazon App Store is that they have a free app of the day. And that's actually what you saw going on in the video. Um, I downloaded that, and this is it, Sonic CD. And this is the free app of the day. This is actually a $2.99 app. Um, I've gotten $16.00 app when the app is free for the day it is free for the day um and i used to be really really a big stickler about going into this app and checking it every day but they give you all the apps all of the apps at some point come up free for the day like this sonic cd and this is actually a game i've been wanting so i was excited to see that game um for free um today i've gotten um uh, snapshot um well, I can just show you. I think I can show you the list of my apps here. Yeah. So I've gotten, um, this is what's on the cloud. These are all the ones. I've got this ACT printer. It's a virtual printer. I got that for free. I think that was a $9.99 app. Um, I got um, Snapshot or SnapTop. I'm trying to find it. I think the easiest way to show it to you. Oh, I got paper camera from here for free. Um, that's another app. I think that's two ninety nine. Um, I got it on the day that it was free. Um, all of these uh, paper talk, voice recorder. I got that for free on here. I don't know how much that cost. Um, What what is Splash Top? Oh, here it is. Splash Top Remote Desktop. This is a fifteen ninety nine app, and I got that on here for free the day that it was free. Um, it was about a year and a half ago, but like that's the one thing I love about the Amazon market is that they don't just give you crappy um, apps. They give you the real deal. They give you the real apps um, for free. So I really like that about the Amazon market. But it's pretty much um, like the Play Store. Um, I don't think it has as many apps. It also has some apps that the Play Store doesn't have, which is another reason you may want to get this Amazon App Store. Um, but it has all of the basic essential same apps like Pandora, Flacker. Um, I don't think it has any of the Google uh, the Google apps. Let me see. That may be... Oh, wait a minute. I see Google Play. I see Google Chrome. I see the Google Play Store. I see Google Maps. Let's see. Because Google Maps is here. Is it? Oh, yeah. So that's it. They don't have any of the Google apps. So if you actually want Google apps, you have to go to the Google Play Store. I guess they just had them listed because all of those usually go together in the search. Um, let's 
to do the play. Yeah, so they have different markets. Okay, so that's one thing that you can't get from the Amazon market or Google Play apps or Google. But, I mean, they're free on the Google market. Um, another thing that um, I like about the uh, Amazon app store is that they're, it's pretty much like the Google Play store. My apps, the ones that I don't necessarily want. Like right now I have a SD card that's pretty small, so I don't have any of my games on it. And I don't have um, any of the apps that I don't use every day. So I can just leave them on the cloud. Um, Dead Runner. This is another one that I got for free. This one is $4.99. This game here. But I got it on here. So I do use it for the games that I, that I got for free that are paid games. Um, this is an ad-free version of Dead Runner. Um... And so I do use it for that, you know, I use it for um, the applications that are on here that aren't on the Google Play Store. But um, I don't like the fact, let me just say that, that they forced me to keep the Play Store on my phone um, in order to use the apps that I download. But that's a small thing, it's not a big deal. So this was the Amazon App Store. Um, I'll put the version that I'm using down in the description. It's the newest version. I just downloaded it. Actually, let me see if I can go to um, the website. This is the website that I downloaded it from. Um, it's uh, www.amazon.com. But I'll put that also in the description so you can know where to go to get it. Um, but you pretty much got to go to Amazon, um, the Amazon online. Um, to get the app store. So I already did all of that and I got to this page. So I'm going to put the um, link to this specific page so you can download the Amazon app store, but you got to get it online. All right, so this is the Amazon app store, and I hope that this video helps someone. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.